All right, waking up to a much more mild day across central Montana today. Still cold though along the High Line, northeastern Montana, single digits, 35 in Great Falls, 19 in the capital. We'll continue to see those temperatures trend a little bit. We are tracking some wind today. Not bad though, maybe gusts 20 to 30 miles per hour at times. Right now a little bit windy in Great Falls at 17 and uh, northeastern Montana. We do still have a wind chill advisory in that region due to the very cold temperatures and you throw a little wind on top of that. Today's wind gust forecast through the noon hour again, only about 15 sustained at times, maybe gusts a little bit more, but pretty minimal, especially for central Montana standards, just enough to help push those temperatures a little bit. 48 degrees. Can you believe that? I promise that's not a typo. Much colder in northeastern Montana, though, looking at the mid 20s there, a little bit warmer in northeastern Montana, even the capital getting to about 41 degrees tonight or today. And then tonight it's still going to be a little bit cold, maybe just below freezing. But man, I walked out this morning and even with 30s, it's like heat wave. You can almost drive to work with the windows down, right? 30 degrees tonight, 24 in the capital, looking at the teens in northeastern Montana as well. As for Tuesday, uh, tomorrow, we do have the possibility of a couple little mountain flurries making their way into central Montana. In other words, can't rule them out, but the chances are very, very minuscule tomorrow. We've got the slightest little weather disturbance moving through late Tuesday in the afternoon uh, through Wednesday morning. Uh, that's going to take temperatures and, and uh, continue to push them up, though, as that system moves through about 48 degrees in Gray Falls, 44 in the capital, a couple of mid 30s in northeastern Montana. Here's how that system is going to play out. So up to Wednesday now, just a little area of low pressure that's going to move through, uh, bringing just a dose of snow there. But following that area of low pressure, more high pressure is going to build and that's just going to stick with us all week long and really dominate the forecast all week, pushing the temperatures to the next level. So we'll see 48 degrees for Martin Luther King Jr. Day today, uh, sticking with that on Tuesday. Little hiccup in the temperatures Wednesday, Thursday with the passage of that system, but really for the most part, uh, check it out 49 by this next weekend. It's like golf weather, right? Uh, 41 today, a little bit breezy at times in the capital and then well into the 40s to follow, Shannon.